and this is your host, Bill McNeely on Daphne Radio Station. Find your perfect match at 193.8, presenting to you the Rose Cooper Mystery Series, brought to you by Duralight. Lighting up your world since 1931. Scene 1, Garden Estates, Upstate New York. At the Cooper household in upstate New York, thick smoke wafts into the crisp, cool air from a blazing inferno. Charles! Victoria! John! No! Scene 2, Garden Estates, upstate New York, Van Deshaun's penthouse. One day before the inferno at the Cooper household, a meeting occurred at Cartier Van Deshaun's penthouse. Okay. So remember to enter all the orders twice into the system, and I'll give you 30% of all the money. Cartier, what are you talking about? Nothing, John. It sounded like something to me. You're a fraud, Cartier. What are you talking about, John? I'm not a fraud. He knows. He must be eradicated. Scene 3, Garden Estates, Upstate New York, Cooper Household. Now we are back to the day after the horrific happening at the Cooper Household. As the police chief of the Garden Estates, I hereby claim the deaths of the entire Cooper family accidental by the coal burning stove in the kitchen. Uh, sir, there is one person still alive. Now for a quick word for our journal sponsor, Duralight. Lighting up your world since 1931. The all-new Duralight Lightning Power light bulb is sleek and powerful, putting out a whopping wattage of 1 million volts. It's also heart healthy with a normal temperature at only 100 degrees Fahrenheit. Touch it all you want. Duralight is not sponsored for any interest in this podcast. What, Gary? How? She climbed out a window, sir. Impossible, Gary. I suggest you bring her to me right now. Beg your pardon, sir, but I'm already here. And may I ask, miss, what is your name? My name is Rose. Rose Cooper. So, you're the daughter of the dead guy? Of course she is. Rose, I'm sorry for such an inconsiderate comment to be said at this horrible time for you. But, Officer Hadlow, could there be another possibility? Maybe. What if someone deliberately lit my house on fire, Officer Hadlow? Miss Cooper, are you suggesting that this was our sin? Why, I certainly am, Officer Hadlow. Sorry to say, Rhodes, but such a thing is never happening in the Garden Estates, and we already have evidence pointing in another direction that the coal-burning stove was left on. But Mama never left the coal stove on at night. She said it was a waste of money and it got dirt, sudden and ash everywhere. I'm sorry, Rose, but maybe your mom just left the coal stove on by accident. But no, she wouldn't have. I'm sorry, Rose, but you don't have any evidence. I can't go searching for something that isn't there. I can't believe that police chief dismissed me like that. I know what I'm going to do, but first I'm going to have to take a look at the evidence. Our detective is making her way through the burnt rubble of her house. Papa's old office? What is this? Rose sees an old safe, still standing. Its heavy door barely still open. It's slightly burnt, but it looks like some of it's still legible. It says, Deshaun, Mitted, Fraud, Prosecute, April 9th. Then Deshaun enters. Why, hello, Rose. my light bulbs work. They don't work because they aren't powered with the all-new Duralight Lightning Power Light Bulb. They are guaranteed to last for your lifetime. Brought to you by Duralight. Lighting up your world since 1931. Duralight's not sponsored for any years. Ah! Wh- what are you doing here, Mr. Vandershawn? Oh, I just came to pay my respects to the house your father lived in. You know, he and I were good friends. Of course, Mr. Vandershawn. Might you know of any arsonist recently released from prison? Why, yes, Rose. It was in the news. A man named Mickey Dunn. Oh, Mr. Vandershawn, could you help me find him? Why, of course. I think he lives in the old little shotgun house on Cherry Lane. Thank you, Mr. Vandershawn. Scene 4, Cherry Lane, Garden Housing Development, Upstate New York. Now Rose is approaching that small house on Cherry Lane, ready to face a man who might have killed her father. Hello? Are you Mickey Dunn? Oh, yes, I am. And may I ask your name, young miss? My name is Rose. And may I ask you, you some questions, Mickey? Sure. What have you done since you were out of prison? Nothing really. Just looking for a job. 
Oh, so you haven't done anything, but you are my only suspect, Mickey. Suspect? What? My house was burnt to the ground and my family was killed. Well then, Rose, I'm sorry for your loss, but was there anybody at the scene of the incident when you were there? Most of our students will take a look at the work after they've done it. Well, there was one person that was there while I was looking through the burnt rubble of my house. His name was... His name was... Tell me, Rose, who? Cartier. Cartier Vandershawn. Well, then go get him, Rose. Breaking news! The U.S. just declared war on Japan. Let's take a moment of silence for our loved ones we lost on the day of December 7th. And now for the weather. Today there is a high of 78 degrees and a low of 65 degrees. Right now it is mostly cloudy with a temperature of 73 degrees. Later there is a 30% chance of rain. The first computer controlled by software was created recently and it is called the Z3. It is expected that in 60 years over 85 million people will own computers. Yesterday there was a huge spike in Duralite light bulb sales and it is quickly getting popular. Everyone thinks it is much better than light ups light bulbs. We would like to say thank you to Duralite light bulbs for bringing us the news. Now back to the story. Scene 5, Garden Estates, Upstate New York, Van Deschamps Penthouse. Why, hello there, Rose. Mr. Van I have a question. Ask me. Ask me anything. Mr. Van I know. I know what you've done. What are you talking about, Rose? I, I've, I've done nothing. The fraud, the arson. I knew my dad was going to prosecute you. Okay, so what if I did it? You can't prove anything, girl. No, you're wrong. They heard you. This entire conversation has been recorded. The police are already here. No. No. What? No. You are under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be... Thank you for listening in. This has been the Rose Cooper Mystery Series, brought to you by Duralite. Lighting up your world since 1931. Make sure to tune in next on Daphne Radio Station. Find your perfect matchup, 193.8.